two things going on here. One, my camera has this new battery in it, which is freaking huge. It says 365 minutes runtime while recording right now. Whoa, no, it, 404 minutes. It just jumped up. <laughs> I got 404 minutes out of this battery right now. Okay, just put a new double A in my camera mic. Got the Sencore on the other 1990 Sears. <laughs> Grayscale track, um, the cutoff low tracking. Uh, we did have it all even, but damn it. Da da da. Having fun with this thing already. So I just had to show you this. Remember, I had told you I couldn't get the track properly on the low end? Well, it ain't happening. <laughs> Okay, emission and high tracking test. The green gun, which was apparent when I did it because it was all blue, is the weakest. The other gun seem, oh, the red gun seems good. Blue gun, sort of there. All right. Okay, I'm just following this little chart here. I'm gonna press for emission life for 10 seconds. Now, if I recall what the thing said, emission lights where it reduces the um, heater voltage. That's the thing. Um, I got this manual here. I do not have the other, if there is another manual. This is all everything that's in here. So. Now, just for the hell of it, I am going to try at least to reactivate. I mean, I don't care if I blow it up. You know, let's see here. I was just playing around with it. I um, ran it on reactivate and ran it for 30 seconds. And this is what happened. I did it until the ready light went out. Now it says all the guns are good. This is awesome. This TV has an intermittent problem now. That's probably the, why it blew the fuse in the first place. When I turned it on, now the picture sh shrunken. Plug it back in. When I first plugged it in, it wouldn't come on at all. So I checked the fuses. Now, watch. It's making some funky noises. I'm turning it off, it's snapping at me. It's all I need is something to start stinking and smoking. Yeah, the right side of the screen was shrunk and it was just sizzling back there now. As to why the, you know, it's probably a winding shorting on the oak. That's probably why the fuse blew in, but I just find it odd that it worked perfectly all those times I had it off and on back in, um, when was it, earlier this year. It sucks, I didn't even get a chance to experience if the tube worked well or not. Wow. That is screwed up. I mean, it worked perfectly earlier this year. Now I'm able to get it to come on, but it sizzles and the screen's like half air. It does sound like it's arcing in the yoke. Oh yeah, 514 minutes on my battery right now. <laughs> but yeah, so now I know what to expect, sort of. You know, but the only thing I did was the reactivate function. I didn't go any higher than that. And it zaps it with the uh, one milliamp current. I mean, it brought it out of the bad zone and the gun tracking went good. I'm gonna have a lot of fun with this. I just can't wait. But I guess my question being, is this all yours has is this manual here, the setup book. I don't have I don't see any other manuals with this. This this simplified test setup right here. 